breaking crypto news. Let's start with Algorand. We know they just launched FIFA NFTs for the World Cup. We know it happened about two weeks ago. Let's see how that is going. So far, they have sold 78,000 packs already for $5 each. We're just getting started. Billions of fans all around the world for soccer and football taking advantage of this huge partnership throughout the World Cup. Here's another massive deal for Algorand, the World Economic Forum, the most elite group in the world. This smart sensor is forming a global air quality map to protect you from dangerous pollution levels. They are advertising, they are pumping this application that runs on top of Algorand, absolutely massive, staying on top of the data for these early stage assets, including the earliest stage assets, the ones you've never heard of, like LivePeer. LivePeer network usage increased 12% in Q3 2022. This is quarterly minutes of video transcoded on the LivePeer network, 37 million minutes in Q3, just growing exponentially. This is Q2 2021. Massive use cases for this decentralized video streaming network. Is it a competitor to Theta? Probably but it's why we stay on top of the data. Here's another asset that everyone is sleeping on, Chainlink, the backbone of Web3. But they also have massive partnerships and use cases with huge companies like the NBA. For instance, the NBA launched these dynamic NFTs. This is how it works. So they have these players in the NBA. Whenever they do something, like win a 2022 NBA championship, a trophy gets added to the NFT. Or if they hit a shot from 30 plus feet away, they get a button or something to differentiate this NFT. It's dynamic. It's all happening on Chainlink. Chainlink is massively revolutionary technology. And that is why in the last week they had 22 integrations. Most blockchain assets would be happy to get this in one quarter or one year. But this was in one week for Chainlink. Absolutely massive. What is going on? 